Yo guys, this is your boy Bammer on today. We're gonna to be talking about how to recover your lost save files in Tiny Tina's Wonderland. First step is you open a file manager, go to this PC, go to your C drive, go to user, whatever your username is, go to documents, go to my games, then go to Tiny Tina's, then go to save. And go to save games all right so once you get to this folder here this is what you're going to see well you're not going to see exactly this is what you're going to see something like it because i actually already did it already so i can't really show you exactly how the folder was going to look but i'm pretty sure it looks something like this when i did it you have your regular save you save rf or whatever this is called temp you got your profile save and your quick save but for whatever reason when you just happen to open up epic games and open up your tina tiny wonderland tiny tina's wonderland your save will come corrupt this save right here so what you would do is you go to properties or just rename i usually go to properties you type dot corrupt if i can fucking spell i fucking can't spell holy shit once you finally get to this point where you actually can spell corrupt, you type that, you click OK, it's going to say this, just click OK, it's going to say corrupt, click on this, rename this, you just delete all of this, click that, it's going to say the same shit, just click yes, and that's going to become your save, you open up your game, and I can't recreate what the epic launcher is going to say, I could try to. It might just open up the game it's just smaller so hit on the screen but yeah you click launch yeah it's not going to do it. it's already saying syncing is already running so i'm gonna just exit out of that and open it up fucking close that shit but once you open it up it should say new or older one is going to say local and one is going to say cloud so it usually says the cloud is newer what you want to do is download your local device to the cloud so you could get your old save back onto the epic servers and shit so you could run one of your old saves all right if doing this doesn't work what you could do is after you try it this way take this you just throw this into the trash bin Take that, throw it into the trash bin. My trash bin is actually on my other screen, which you can't see, but you throw that into the trash bin. Keep this as corrupt. Take this save, and then you change that to one dot save. Do that, and it should work. And once this works, what I did after that is I just have, I just copied. If it worked, I just went here, click this to copy the save. Well, it can't be copied because it's not an actual thing. It's just, this is just a notepad that I wrote high in and changed it from save. Pretty sure if I put dot notepad at the end, it should work as a notepad again. But you would click this right here to copy it. Then you click this, you click paste over here and it would paste your game save onto your desktop or whatever folder you want to have it in. And if your saves ever get corrupted again, you just drag that save in there and drop it. Now I recommend you, what's it called? I recommend that you copy your save game every time after you're done playing it until they finally update the game where all of this shit is fixed because DirectX 12 is acting up on this game and a lot of other shit is acting up on this game. So until they actually update a fix where this is never gonna happen again, just every time you're done playing the game, even if it's for a few minutes or hours, just come over here, copy it, copy it to desktop. The old save that you have on your desktop, just replace it. And yeah, you should never have this problem again. If this fix your problem and you actually enjoy watching the videos, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And yeah, it's been Bamron.